Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I am just gonna do like a chit chat, get ready with me video today. And I also am gonna be um, putting the winners for my Morphe giveaway um, in my description box. So don't forget to check that out. Um, thank you so much for everybody that entered everything. Stay tuned because I probably will be doing another one. I do have some exciting things in the works for this next week, some collabs that's gonna be pretty cool. Um, so do keep a look out because I'm going to be doing a lot of giveaways and I appreciate everybody that did enter in this time. It was a really good turnout for me and I appreciate it. So let's just get started, girl. So I am just going to go in with my Smashbox Photo Finish Foundation. Now I have had like a lot of requests of like what's my favorite primer. I would say this would probably be my favorite. It's um, oil free. It's a photo finish foundation primer by Smashbox. I got this little one from Ulta just to try it out to see if I did like it and I absolutely love it. Um, but I probably use like a handful of them and I would say out of those, like those are all great ones and I love them, they'll do the trick. But this one's my all time favorite. That's what I would have to say. So I did get this new foundation and I actually got two and I just don't know which one I'm going to use yet. That's why I'm kind of like slowing it down. So I'm either going to use the L'Oreal um, Inflatable Pro Glow and this is the natural beige, the 205 and it says it's 24 hours um, foundation. I don't know if I'm going to use this one. I am really, really excited that I got this. I've heard, like, good things on YouTube about them that, like, people have said that's, like, such great foundation. But I also got the Fit Me, um, the Matte Poreless Foundation, and mine is in, let's say, Rich Tan. It doesn't look that tan. So, that's what I'm think. I think I'm going to go towards this. I'm pretty excited about it. It looks like it's going to do good. So I've heard really good things. So we are just going to probably use this. The only thing I don't like for some reason. I don't like foundations that it's just like this hole. Because I feel like I just don't. I don't know. I don't like that. I like it to be like either like the squeeze kind. Or the pump kind. Or like the little spatula thing. So I do, I had fake eyelashes on, I went to Bear Lake and now it's like getting these, they're like throwing up gang signs right now I need to either like figure out if I'm going to get them redone or if I'm going to let them go and it's just like uh, killing me. So I do like it. I have kind of like, now that it's like summertime, a pretty oily face which is super weird because I normally don't have an oily face. I normally have a very dry face. So it's a little weird. Um, now we gotta do my brows. I feel like I'm gonna go do my brows and I will be right back. Okay, I'm back. Did my brows, I'm back in action. So now we're just gonna go in with some concealer. Um, I did just get this, well, not just, probably like a week ago, this Maybelline, um, Master Conceal, and this one's the light medium, just like a little squeezer outer, so, it, oh, oh, come, focus, homie, focus, there you go, so, that's what I'm gonna be using, and where did that work? Too much.
in with the Maybelline Fit Me Matte Poreless Powder in the Buff Beige. So it looks like this. Opens up and then you flip this up and it has like a mirror which I like and this little thing and I actually tried it out the other day. So I like, I like, I really, really like so far. I'm gonna just set my I actually forgot guys to tell you what palette I was using and I've really been loving the Carly Bible palette by BH Cosmetics. I've literally used like one fourth of the colors just for this eye look and I literally love it. I just want to let you guys know. Okay, so I am going to use these lashes. I think they are so cute. So cute. And then I just got this um, Bring the Salon Home Kiss um, adhesive glue. And I've heard this is really good. My friend actually uses it and she loves it. I normally use the Duo. But I'm out and I went to the store and I thought I would try this one. So that's what we're trying. And it just comes out like this and it's white. Which is different because I normally use the gray one. And I love, when I used my friends, I liked it. I thought I did a good job. And I like this little spoolie thingy that it has to put on because I don't have my nails anymore. I'm so sad. Um, so I'm actually going to use this. I've seen this on a few people's channel and um, I heard great things about it. So this is the Bo F the Lash Paradise by L'Oreal and this is in the blackest black. And I heard it's supposed to be really good. So, And I think this is cute, like this like rose goldish thing. So let's take it out. It's cute. It's like super light. That's weird. So we're just going to see for the first And I love these. I don't like the one with the weird ball on the end, but I like these. So let's. Mm, and it smells good. I think I like Ooh. so um and I also did get um which I'm pretty excited about the Maybelline Master Chrome by Face Studios the metallic highlighter and this is the molten gold and everybody is like talking about this, how like amazing this is and stuff so I'm excited too and this is like like really it's, it should be like amazing I'm excited so I'm gonna go in with this
it's like, oh, it's like going like butter. I love it. Like it. it's pretty I am gonna go ahead and go on with put it on my brow right here to kind of bring in that I think I make it just look really pretty Cause who don't want to just be glowing every day of the week? Okay. Now I'll just go ahead and do my lips. And I actually just got these like little things from, I think Ross, this isn't Milani, is it? No, this is called Mauveless. I'm into the mauve. And I really like going with the lighter color. And hit in the middle. I think it's beautiful. And I always go in with this. And then I will go in the Makeup Forever uh, Mist and Fix. Okay, so this is the final look. I think it came out really good. I really like it. Um, so I hope you enjoyed watching me learn with you. Um, also, don't forget to check the description box because I am going to um, list my winners for my Morphe giveaway. And um, don't be sad if you didn't win because I am going to do another giveaway with another smaller YouTuber like myself this week. Um... So keep an eye out for that, and don't forget to hit that bell, and subscribe to your girl's channel, and help her out. So, yes. And I also would love if you guys left um, pink hearts, if you guys wanted to see a beauty room tour, and my makeup collection. Yes. But I'm loving this. Like, this foundation, mm, I'm loving it. So, thank you guys again so much for watching. I had so much fun. I love chit-chatting with you guys, um, learning with you guys, and trying new product with you guys. I'm always going to be 100% honest with you if I like it or if I don't like it. So, I appreciate all of you guys who entered in my drawing. I love that you guys watch it, and I think you guys can learn from it. And I think if you guys have ideas for me or anything like that, I would love to hear from them. Leave them in the comments below. Remember, pink heart if you guys want to see a beauty room tour and also uh, my makeup collection. So let me know.